Hello everyone, welcome to Heel Charm Shine. In today's video, we are going to see Are They The One? Thank you so much for being here. Thank you uh, for all your shares, all your comments, all your likes, all, all the subscriptions. I'm so humbled, I'm so happy and I am so grateful for everybody who is uh, coming, spending their time on the channel and also uh, giving their feedback. Thank you so much. I am really grateful. Now, uh, before I start, let me say one thing that uh, no one can tell you this, that if they are the right one, if they are the one, if they are the one you should end up with, it is completely upon you. You have the free will, you have the power, you need to make the choice. But we are just going to ask the angels, the spirit guides, our ancestral guides, if we can get some suggestion some guidance in that situation so let's go ahead and see if the person you're thinking about or if the person you're currently dating is your person is the is your true love or is someone you should end up with or is someone you uh, are meant to be with so let's start with pal number one thank you again for being here i love you all thank you so much and i hope um, uh, my videos keep uh, making you f uh, happy and keep uh, answering your questions thank you again for being here i'll see you in the inside the reading i'll start with pile number one thank you so much for being here pile, no pile number one welcome to your reading today's reading is are they the one uh, let's see what the spirit guides have to tell what what suggestion the spirit guides have and uh, definitely do uh, consider that uh, no one can tell you that if they are the one and all uh, you are you can make your own choice you have the free will and this is your choice after all we are just asking for some guidance from the spirit guide so let's see the person you're thinking about or the person you are currently with if they are the one for you if they are your true love or if they uh, are someone you should spend the rest of your life with Let's see what the spirits have to say. So the first card we got over here is about sexual freedom. So this card is um, about being free. Uh, this card is about not feeling uh, any kind of burden or any kind of obligation or any kind of restriction that you should do this and you should not do this or your the codependency feeling or the feeling that you owe some owe something owe sexual favors to your partner so that kind of feeling if if your partner tries to dominate you in that way then that is not the person because the person you are you are you should be with or you are meant to be with is going to make you feel completely free is going to make you give is going to make you is going to cherish you actually and not going to make you feel that you owe them something or you need to do something which uh, the other persons uh, which uh, the other person uh, wants or the other person has to experience and even if you're uncomfortable they'll force you to do that if that kind of relationship you were in the past then this relationship is going to heal you heal you come out of it if there was any kind of trauma any kind of emotional manipulation any kind of uh, physical abuse or any kind of abuse trauma you went through then this person is going to help you heal that and make you free many time when people go through those kind of uh, experiences those kind of past then they start uh, feeling very negative about uh, their se own sexuality they don't want to express themselves physically they want to keep uh, themselves hidden or they don't want to they are very scared about getting involved with someone but this person is a complete healer this person is someone who is going to make you feel safe not only safe but also cherished they are going to celebrate this moment with you the moment of being together the, the intimacy they are going to celebrate they are going to held you high like the lotus flower the way it rises above the mud the way it rises above its uh, surrounding even if your past was of painful even if your past was dark even if your past was something which you don't want to continue in your life right now they will help you move above it the lotus petals don't let the mud touch it it just rolls away so the same way they are not going to let your past traumas your past experiences touch you they are going to keep you protected the way they are embracing each other the way they are looking into each other's eyes they want to be 
come they want to shield you from the outer world they want to keep you only for themselves and that is not a possessive this is not a obsession or possessive kind of behavior this is more of a protective kind of energy more of a energy where they where they do want to keep you away from harm if they when they will know about any past trauma or any past uh, experiences in your life they are not going to use it to manipulate you in fact they are going to help you overcome that they will help you forget that and they will help you move beyond that and this is a very peaceful energy because we have these two beautiful white doves over here we have this lotus over here we have the heart and we have these butterflies over here so it's a very peaceful energy it is all about peace and love this is a gem of a person this person will make you feel so safe and protected and so at peace that you will uh, feel like you have been rescued from a life of a, from a difficult uh, life or of or a life which you were not even aware of uh, rescued that uh, rescued from like uh, the like you were caged into some negative uh, environment and now this person has come as your knight in shining armor and is taking you out of it we have the fire and we have the water over here so one of you might be a fire sign and the other one might be a water sign or have these uh, dominant in their birth chart and uh, the way it is not empower it is not uh, trying to dominate each other it is staying in harmony it is existing in harmony that is the that is the kind of feeling which i see when i see this card and this really is a gem of a person they are going to keep you a uh, very very closely to their heart that is why they they are held holding each other so close like they are, they want to keep you close to their heart not uh, and they want to keep you completely protected completely in their own shell in their own shield and that is how they want to see you they want to give you a you give you their crown they want to make you their queen or their king take as it resonates and it is a complete transformation this relationship should feel like a complete transformation it should feel like it is taking you away from any trauma any past experiences and it is rising you it should not make your life more difficult it should may feel like your life has become easier everything about well, your career your job your uh, relationships your family your history your trauma or trauma your experiences everything starts becoming starts making sense and starts feeling that it is getting resolved and your ex and your day to day life your everyday life starts becoming easier you should feel protected when you are with this person you should feel happy when you are with this person you should feel cherished this person should have their eyes only on you and not wandering everywhere else they should uh, hold you at a very a uh, high uh, standard like they should keep you hold like they should keep you on a pedestal and make you feel only good and if and that this is an infinite and this is an infinity symbol even this talks about dna over here so definitely when you meet this person you will see a change in not only your behavior or your mindset but even in your looks because you will feel so feel so happy within that your entire dna is going to change your entire the happiness is going to reflect on your face that happiness is going to reflect in your body in your health your health will should start improving your skin should start getting clear your uh, hair should feel more soft and more beautiful and you should you when you start feeling happy inside you start feeling beautiful and cherished inside it shows on your face it shows on your body and that is how you will know that you are with the right person that is how you will know that yes this is the person who's helping me blossom who's helping me uh, become the best version i can be who's helping me fly who not not to stay restricted be a free bird who's helping me become enjoy my freedom and not uh, feel that you owe something to someone or you need to uh, stay you know into someone's dominance or uh, ask permission for someone that kind of feeling should not be then if you feel like you are completely free if you feel like you are completely happy if you feel physically you start feeling uh, beautiful you start looking good you start feeling 
uh, good within you start feeling healthier then that is the person you are meant to be then this is your this is your person then this is the person you should spend the rest of your life with now let's see what more messages are coming in wow i really love this card this card first of all i find this person very attractive so maybe your person is very attractive someone who looks a, a bit like this guy uh they might have facial hair the male in the relationship might have facial hair and they might have longer hair longer than normal uh hair as well and uh, they might have brown or dark like black or black brown brown kind of hair this person can can be an aries and uh, the hunter over here is talking about track down your fears and desire so they are going to help you overcome any fears any traumas which we already felt in this if you went through any any kind of uh, disappointments in your past relationships or even in your childhood or uh even if you don't know uh, those were your past life experiences you don't know but you have some kind of fear some kind of traumas because everybody has some kind of phobias right we are scared of height we are scared of water we are scared of darkness we are scared of many things which we can't explain which we don't know because we have never experienced that trauma in our li in our life but we still fear that and those are those are related some some people believe and even i believe that those are related to our past life experiences and that's why we have that fear so whatever your fear is what if it is something which is holding you back it if it is something which is holding you behind if it is something which is not letting you move uh, uh, towards your goals not being your or uh, not letting you be the best version you can be then this person is going to help you hunt down those fears this person is going to help you feel like you can conquer that and you can move beyond that you can definitely uh, leave those uh, obstacles behind and move beyond those obstacles and achieve the goals you can you want to achieve they might even have body art something very attractive something which will uh, look which you which you will find attractive and uh, or you may have a body art which they will really love and uh, cherish and uh, see we can see spirals if it is hard to see it is like very uh, light in this like in it's black and black itself so it's hard to see on camera but there are spirals three spirals over here so you might be seeing a, and we have spirals on his body art as well so you might be seeing a lot of 333 three, three, or you might be seeing a lot of synchronicities and uh, the spirals also talk about the divine plan the divine protection how the universe keeps expanding in a spiral way so everything will happen as per the divine plan as per the divine's uh, you know uh, the way the divine wants you to keep involving keep learning from your experiences it is going to happen as per your choices as well and as per your karmic uh, comic account that what you went through how you uh, dealt with what kind of people so the more uh, loving you are with everybody around you the the better it will be or the easier it will be for you to bring in this energy and this person is not only going to help you overcome your fears but also move towards your destinations move towards your desires achieve your goals many time we have fears which Uh, become obstacles for us to achieve our goals like if you have stage fright but you want to be a speaker or you want to be a singer so this person is going to help uh, help you overcome that and achieve your goal of becoming that uh, singer or the speaker or whatever you want to do and your fears are holding you back they are going to help you overcome that and move towards your goal so they are going to help you develop not only in your personal life or they are not going to help you develop your soul but also in your professional life as well so if the if the person you are with is going is helping you become better is helping you uh, enrich your life more then that is your person then that is the person you are meant to be with and then they are the one and we can see a handprint over here as well so they are going to two handprints so they are going to keep leave a mark on your heart on and on your soul and so are you and this is not only one lifetime you are spent you are experiencing with them this this is 
is going to keep continuing for multiple life lifetimes it's going to keep happening for multiple lifetimes it is not something which people feel that karmic is a difficult relationship or karmic is only a lesson no karmic is also what you experience or what you uh, have contract with the person that you want to be with this person again and again you go through so many experiences that you have a lot of karmic accounts you need to settle with that person and you are going to experience being with them again and again because you have meant you have made that contract you have chosen each other you want to be with them this person also has long hair so your person might have longer hair than usual okay okay another person with these antlers they look so similar look at these they both look similar and they are from two different decks they have the same kind of uh, antlers coming out of their head same kind of horns coming out of their head wow let's see what this card is this card is all about fertility um this uh, serenus is the life force which brings life on earth and we have the similar kind of spirals the spirals over here and spirals over here so definitely this is happening as per the divine's plan as per the divine's desire this goes smoothly like everything grows in the nature smoothly right you don't have to rush anything you don't have to yell at a shower come on oh, sorry or yell at a flower come on grow 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 no it will bloom in its own time the same way everything happens in the in its own time in the nature you you can't hurry something you can't yell at a tree to grow or to give fruits it will give it in the in its own season the same way Uh, you you cannot yell at yourself or force yourself to keep uh, to achieve something in a set time no everything happens in its own season everything happens it's in in its own time and that is what these spirals are all about it will happen it will continue it will go smoothly you don't have to force something to happen stay with the stay with the plan stay on the plan keep doing what you what you are meant to do keep doing what whatever uh, you feel like doing or whatever downloads you are getting whatever messages are getting you are getting keep working on those and your and the life force of the universe the life force the shakti which keeps everything everything moving which keeps everything going the energy in physics in the scientists call it energy we we will call it divine or god in uh, hindu mythology it is shakti so whatever it is whatever you believe in the energy force in chinese it is chi whatever the energy force is whatever the life force is it is working in your favor it is helping you bring this person this person who might have facial hair if it if you are looking for a man this person who might have brown beautiful long brown hair this person who has piercing eyes whose eyes are so set on you whose gaze is set on you they they just when they find you or when they connect with you they don't want to deal with anybody else they only want to be with you and they will hold you like their queen they will hold you like something delicate something so precious something they don't want to let go it is not about possession it is about not about obsession it is about admire admiration it is about you know feeling that you are so valuable that they don't want to let you go and the moon shining over here is talking about any kind of the moon is small over here so whatever you need to release you need to release the moon goes through a phases right like it goes from it from new moon to full moon so the small moon you might be feeling that you are not good enough or you are small or this is too good to be true but no you are growing you will grow into that person i'm not talking about physical growth i'm talking about emotional growth i'm talking about spiritual growth you will definitely grow moon is about your emotions about intuitions your intuitions are growing you are getting the downloads you are becoming the true version or you are becoming uh, spiritually aware it the growth is coming in your life your emotional growth your spiritual growth is coming in your life and how you can grow beyond uh, your current situation is 
through expressing your driving passion sensual and sexual powers are increased yes we have sexual freedom and we have this again a very highly sexual card over here because this is about life force this is a very fertile card and it talking about your sensual and sexual powers are being increased so if you were uh, feeling any kind of shame or guilt or any kind of trauma which you have experienced in your past then that is going to get removed and you are going to feel powerful you are feel going to feel empowered you are going to feel that yes you deserve true love yes you deserve true happiness you as you deserve a uh, physical intimacy where you feel safe so that is what is going coming towards you and that is how you should feel with this person then that is your true person and this also talks about expressing your driving passion so whatever you are passionate about be it uh, your career be it your job be it uh, something in spirituality be it something for the environment because this is all about greenery about life on earth be it for animals whatever you are passionate about you need to st uh, start spending some time on it you need to start working on it and you need to uh, start getting some downloads from it as well let's see what else we are getting from the tarot temperance okay so you need more balance in your life temperance is about balance so maybe your emotion and your your uh, emotions and your physical needs are not feeling getting the balance or getting the time or getting the energy from you so you need to bring in more balance or you need to balance your uh, chakras so you definitely can meditate for it meditate and bring in that energy and there is stability coming in your life the pyramid the triangle over here is the most stable or the strong structure the strong shape and there is stability you will feel stable if you were not feeling stable before then you should feel very stable with this person and then you know that uh, this is the person there should not be any fear that you will lose them or they will go away or they will choose someone else if that kind of fear is coming in your mind then that is not your person uh, now temperance is also the sagittarius card and uh, you or your person might have sagittarius in their birth chart and uh, it is also about your patience and purpose so you need to be more patient if something is not happening in and you are getting impatient then you need to bring in the energy of patience you need you need to understand that everything blooms in its own time everything happens in its own in its own time patience is really something which you should work on and also work on your purpose whatever your purpose is whatever you are calling is whatever is something you always enjoy doing you need to take it more seriously maybe even turn it into a profession what else page of swords page of pentacles tower and two of cups beautiful so what the we have two pages over here okay so both of you might be very young or at least uh, emotionally you went through a trauma and emotionally you need uh, some uh, you need to grow up or you you there is some Uh, as we felt that there is some potential to grow emotionally or spiritually spiritually emotionally or uh, your age your physical age is uh, young at a younger side which will definitely grow because the page definitely moves beyond this stage and it goes to towards becoming the king the queen even the emperor and the empress so definitely you are going to grow you are going to go beyond physically emotionally or um spiritually that growth is coming in your life so now what are these two page talking about the page uh, the page of sword is uh, about new ideas curiosity thirst of knowledge new ways of communicating so maybe you met this person online maybe you met this person uh, through some work related scenario through some work related case that's why we have the pentacles as well maybe you were do, there was something new which you were doing like a new job or a new um you entered a new dating app or a new um, social media some something new you were started and you met this person that also might be because there is a energy of new over here we also have the tower and uh, something related to your learning even education maybe you uh, enrolled in a new college and you met this person so page of uh, 
सॉर्ट्स इज ऑल अबाउट योर थिंकिंग अबाउट योर नॉलेज अबाउट कम्युनिकेशन सो मे बी दैट इज हाउ यू मेट दिस पर्सन और यू विल मीट दिस पर्सन एंड पेज ऑफ पेंटिकल्स इज ऑल अबाउट योर वर्क अबाउट योर मनी अबाउट योर फाइनेंस अबाउट फाइनेंशियल अपॉर्चुनिटीज इट इज ऑल्सो अबाउट मैन मैनिफेस्टेशन सो दिस पर्सन इज मैनिफेस्टिंग यू द वे दिस पेज ऑफ पेंटिकल इज लुकिंग एट हिज पेंटिकल और यू आई द यू आर मैनिफेस्टिंग दिस पर्सन और दिस पर्सन इज मैनिफेस्टिंग यू and this is and they are bringing this into reality which is again a very very good way uh, you are coming together and uh, the universe is definitely helping you we have this angel over here your angels your spiritual spirit guides your uh, even we have angel over here as well so they are definitely helping you to take this decision if you need to let something go maybe a past relationship maybe a past experience maybe a past trauma something which has created fear something which has made you feel uh, unsafe unsecured uh, or even uh, guilty or bad about your own self any that kind of past structure you created or past life you created with someone you need to let it completely go so maybe you went through went through divorce or loss or breakup or some kind of uh, strong ending where you felt shattered where you felt that oh why did this happen with me why why god why why did i lose this relationship no you didn't lose anything this was meant to come down the divine has taken this away from you because this was not going to serve you in the true way this was not good for you although you felt that you were in a relationship that relationship was not good it was more like uh, like a codependent relationship it was more like a boundation and you deserve freedom your soul deserves freedom your subconscious mind your higher self was was uh, trying for that freedom or was praying for that freedom and the divine heard it the and they and the divine took upon them like themselves the your spirit guides took upon themselves and moved this energy out of your life took away this relationship from your life even if it was a good relationship and you lost the person then that was your karmic contract then that was how many uh, how much experience or how much uh, time you needed to spend with that person that went for a reason a reason for your soul to develop a reason for your soul to experience and you are going to move beyond that energy of pain energy of feeling that you lost something and you are going to move into this energy so if your person the person you are thinking about or the person you are currently with if they make you feel balanced if they make you feel equal if they make you feel cherished if they are giving you the same amount of attention love energy as you are giving them then you are meant to be with this person then they are the one so do uh, think about it that if see how this person treats you do they cherish you do they value you do they make you feel safe do they make you feel protected if they do that if they are giving you their cup of love when they are taking yours if it is a balanced relationship if it is a a healthy relationship then they are the one now two of cups is about unified love about mutual attraction so you should feel that you uh, have that mutual relationship mutual respect mutual attraction then they are the one and this is also about partnership if they make you feel that you are their partner then they are the one a te- a friend a best friend a partner then definitely they are the one they will treat you we we can see so many crowns over here they sh- they would treat you like royalty then they are the one so uh, this is what the cards are telling me and pile number 1 i hope you got the message i hope you uh, found that if the person you are currently thinking about or you are currently with has these uh, qualities or not uh, let's see more information from other tools we can see alphabets charms a lot of things are there let's see e h t make your words let me know if you can find a name or some 
uh, clues or some information, some messages, some guidance, anything. There are so many people watching this and definitely uh, everything will not resonate with everyone. If this pile didn't resonate with you, you can go for the other piles or other readings as well. Doctor, I always get the doctor card and we are, I'm also getting this goal. So they will help you achieve your goal. If you have a goal, then they will definitely help you achieve it. See if you can make any words, any uh, place name, any clues, any information you are getting from this. Now let's see the charms. We have stickers also. Yes, you are supposed to work on your passion. You are supposed to concentrate on your passion. If you, have, if you want to do something which is not uh, related to your day job, then you, you should take some time out for it. This is about working on your passion, concentrating on your passion. Whatever it is, creative work, uh, something you wanted, you always wanted to start, a YouTube channel, uh, a blog, uh, want to teach uh, music, want to uh, get involved in music, want to sing, want to dance, whatever, whatever your passion is. Don't think about it that it will not, uh, it is too late or it is not going to work or it's not going to help you make money. No, do it as a hobby. Do it something which will help your soul heal, which will help you make feel good about yourself. Because even a hobby, even something which helps you feel good about yourself, even if you are not making any money out of it, then also it is going to definitely help you improve the other aspects of your life. And elephant is all about uh, learning from your memories. So you have experienced some kind of trauma in your past and you need to learn lessons from it and make sure that you don't enter into any of those kind of uh, relationships or any of those kind of situations where you have to face that again. So you, the elephant is about learning uh, from your past. It is also about your memories. So release whatever painful memories you have, but don't uh, forget the lessons you learned this is about slowly growing so this relationship is going to slowly grow into something very strong very powerful this leaf is also about shedding this is the autumn leaf so maybe autumn period might be important for you and autumn leaf is also about shedding your past letting go your past this person who you are meant to be with has a very beautiful heart has a very kind heart when people talk to them, they understand that this is a very kind person, a beautiful person, a person who has a very nice soul. And this is about trusting the universe, trusting that whatever is happening is happening for your sake, not uh, against you, but for you. If you went through a tower moment, that tower moment was important in your life at that period, at that stage, so that you can learn that uh, lesson and move beyond those restrictions bring some change which was important in your life you're getting the compass is about you're getting directed you're getting the direction you're getting the feedback you're bet, being directed towards move towards movement like to move to make some changes in your personal life in your professional life and those changes will help you connect with this person this is about focus so you need to focus on your passion focus on what you love you have another focus so you definitely have to focus on something you enjoy doing, something you are passionate about. Number four, you might be seeing a lot of four, four, four. And four is about stability. So you, there is stability which is coming in your relationship and you should feel stable with this person. Then that is the guy, that is the man, that is the woman, that is the girl. Take as it resonates. Beauty. This person is going to make you feel very beautiful, very attractive, very cherished, very loved. star so might be an aquarius or have aquarius in their uh, sun moon or rising and they will also make you feel like a star this is also about hope and faith so even if you can't see this person in your life life right now have hope have faith it is definitely coming money slowly steadily you're going to grow your money this is also about money and the lotus, we saw such a big lotus over here. And the lotus is about rising above any darkness. 
going beyond any darkness going beyond any pain oh you know let not letting your past touch you not letting your past hold you back releasing your past that is what the lotus is all about now let's see what the stickers have to say then the last technique i have is about uh, your uh, i have few handmade cards which will also give a hint about this person It's few more coffee so see if these are giving the hint of your person coffee might be a coffee lover or you might be a coffee lover or would meet on a coffee date greece you or your person might be from greece have uh, their ancestors in greece like uh, have their origin in greece and um, now they are living somewhere else or might travel to greece it's a beautiful location if you are traveling there then wow beautiful october uh, october might be an important period for you we already saw autumn so you or your person may have uh, we have the autumn leaves over here in this card as well so you or your person may have a birthday in october or in autumn months or you might be seeing a lot of 111 1111 also better days ahead this is a confirmation for you another confirmation good days ahead scorpio you or your person might be a scorpio and we had the october as well so you or your person might be a scorpio hmm what else we already saw sagittarius and we have uh, two pe a pentacle and sword sign so we have virgo capricorn uh, gemini libra aquarius and taurus sorry taurus taurus virgo capricorn gemini libra and aquarius we already had that so aquarius in the sword as well aquarius and sagittarius for the temperance and now we got scorpio and we have october so scorpio is a strong possibility dog now i love the dog dog is something which is loyal unconditional love good fortune commitment lifelong commitment being a best friend protection as well which i felt in the first card itself so this person should feel like a best friend should feel very loyal should feel way like a protector then that is the person for you then yes that they are the one taurus you are we already saw taurus so you or your person may have taurus in their birth chart they will have a uh, key to your heart and you will have key to their heart this is key to the heart so definitely you will feel that they have a key to your heart soulmate wow beautiful look at this card this card this card it looks so similar right these people these doves these dolphins they look so similar and even the butterflies dolphin is all about looking at the positive side a dolphin is about focusing on positivity being playful uh, which the dog is also about being playful silver lining focusing on the silver lining and it they are those they are your soulmate so dolphin and dog are very much similar very loyal very honest best friend protector kind of energy which i'm sensing elephant again this is about releasing your past learning from your memories keeping the lesson and letting the trauma go mexico you or your person might have uh, like might be from mexico or would love to travel to mexico that's the spirit that is what one more uh, universal uh, uh thumbs up is coming for you that that's the spirit keep on doing what you're doing something related to music maybe or body art so definitely keep on doing whatever you want to do whatever is making you feel happy whatever is helping you connect with your passions <clears throat> excuse me turkey you or your person may have origins in turkey or would love to visit turkey maybe living in turkey cow now cow is a very generous animal it is all about generosity so this person is going to be very generous with their love towards you they are not going to hold back on anything they are going to be very honest very generous very free flowing complete freedom that is what the cow feels to me and the cow is also believing in miracles it's also very calm and kind which i already felt that this person is very calm very kind uh in this card definitely even this very calm very kind very peaceful and online money you or your person might be making money online now let's see some uh, handmade cards we are going to 
C6 handmade cards to see if we can find any traits about this person any more information about this person and then uh, that will be the confirmation if they are the they are the one loves to laugh ambitious you might have a age gap of two years baker sweet tooth they might be a baker or they might have a sweet tooth or love uh, have eating a lot of sweets or maybe you and they will gift you a lot of bakery or sweets bakery goods or sweets cupcakes and wow nice netflix and chill you might enjoy a lot of netflix and chill time which we can see over here lot of alone time being in your own world the outer world doesn't matter for you at all when you're together campfire stories oh look at these two guys these two are completely wild like they like to be in the nature they are somebody who wants to be outside in the nature in the in somewhere where you can go campaigning so maybe your person loves campaigning maybe your person likes to be in the nature goes on uh, trekking goes uh, lives likes to be uh, among animals likes to be likes to have be under the uh, open sky likes to sleep under the stars so that might be your person and they like to tell camp campfire stories they might be a very good story teller they might have Oh, storytelling abilities might be a writer, author, or love to share stories, love to tell stories, or uh, stories, and uh, that can be a way you know that this is your person. So these are what I felt. Very nice campfire stories, Netflix and chill, loves to laugh, uh, ambitious, two years age gap, baker, or loves to bake or have a has a sweet tooth. That's all for you, pile number one. I'll see you in my next one. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you again for all your subscriptions and all your comments. Um, and I'll see you in my next one. Goodbye. Welcome, pile number two. Thank you so much for being here. Let's see what the spirits have to say about are they the one? Okay. Whoa. Beautiful cards let's go one by one abundance yes look at this card it is so beautiful there is a free flowing of abundance over here there is a free flowing of money first of all this person is a gem of a person this person is not only abundant um, like oh, financially but they are very good but in their heart as well their heart is full of full of happiness full of love they are very generous with their money with their time with whatever the skills they have whatever help them make so much money they are very generous with it so they will definitely be very generous with their love as well this person has follows the guidance of their angels follows the guidance of their of the spirit guide so they are definitely very spiritual they might be someone who meditate and they might be someone who follows their heart who follows their emotions because we can see the water in this cave so that they are definitely very well aware about their emotions about what their heart wants what their soul wants and they follow that and that is how they make their money so they might be doing something which is uh, which they are very passionate about which very, comes very easily to them which they enjoy doing which they love doing and that is helping them make a lot of money that is helping them create a lot of wealth a very uh, power a very health wealthy lifestyle and they are very happy doing this their, their cup is overflowing with not only water but with also a lot of abundance with lot of love with lot of prosperity there is a lot of overflowing energy over here and this is non this cave has the, we can't see a wall over here this cave goes inside as well so this person is very deep they are not a shallow person they are very deep the, you know when you meet them person you understand that they are like onion the, you know you can peel layers out of them and there will still be something hidden about them there will still be some mystery which they will keep they don't open up with everyone they open up they like people know them but people know them for their for their craft for their talent for whatever skill they have or whatever business or whatever 
profession they are into people know them for that but nobody knows their true how truly they are how they are with their with their friends very very close friends or very close family or how they are with uh, the people they love no, not everybody knows that they are very delicate very good with uh, uh, those people they love they cherish them who they love they want to keep them protected they want to keep them hidden this treasure is hidden it is not open for the for the world it is not open for everybody this is hidden for only few people it is hidden for only someone who is very close to their heart very close to their soul now this does not have to be only birth relations this can also be someone who um, they know as friends who they know through their work who they know uh, even uh, their pets even the animals in their life are someone they cherish a lot they love a lot and it they hold them at uh, very close to their heart and they don't mind spending a fortune on people and everything they love even if it is their house they are very possessive about it even if it is their car they are very they they like to keep it at uh, in the best possible way they don't want they don't neglect their possessions whatever the assets they have they don't neglect the important people in their life they definitely don't neglect their pets their family and anybody so if you meet someone who is actually very wealthy but they don't show off who is actually uh, very well connected but they don't misuse those connections or they are not prideful they are not being a jerk about their position about their authority about their money about their wealth they are in fact very humble very down to earth they like to keep that aspect hidden they don't wear flashy clothes and although they are or flashy accessories and they don't they are not in your face i have the money kind of people they are very much uh, people who have a very classy look they are very classy they are not uh, like they they are not the show off kind of people and they don't uh, share their intimate details with everyone see the cave over here is hidden so they they keep their secrets only to themselves and they are awakened actually they are they are spiritually awakened they they are very good manifestors as well we can see this fairy has a magic wand so they are very uh, highly trained manifestors as well they believe in law of attraction they believe in spirituality they believe in power of uh, creating your own world creating in your own reality they believe in power of your mind they believe in um, Uh, all that which people need to create a abundant life and they use it in such a uh, strong way or such a good way or efficient way that it helps them build a very powerful uh, life a very a very stable life the house must be filled with a lot of beautiful things as well uh, and uh, they have story for everything whenever you see a beautiful rug or a beautiful table or a piece of furniture and you ask them about it that wow this is beautiful where did you get it they would have they will have a detailed story about it they cherish everything in their life be it a pencil to be it uh, their own their own house or their own car they will have story for everything they value everything they don't take anything for granted and that is why the universe blesses them with lot of prosperity with lot of abundance so that is the kind of person so if your person is like this then they are the one then they are the they are the they are the one you need to um, hold on to or they they are your true love now stag is trust trust and thrive i did say that they trust in the universe i did say that they trust in the spiritual spirit guides so you are also being called to trust you also being called to trust in the universe you also being called to trust in whatever guidance whatever uh, messages whatever synchronicities whatever the plan universe has for you the spirals and the stag the antlers over here was same in pile number 1 so if you are getting called to check pile number 1 as well do check it out and uh, you are being called to release whatever does not serve you these leaves are dropping these leaves are not staying uh on the tree they are dropping so you need to release whatever does not serve you your past 
you are uh, if a job is somewhere you don't feel appreciated that you need to look for a new job if it is a relationship where you feel that you are not valued then you need to uh, stop take being a part of that relationship you need to release whatever does not serve you if it is a old habit or old pattern where you know that it is not good for you a self sabotaging behavior staying late staying awake late at night you know we can see like dark circles under this stag's eyes so maybe you stay lay awaken late at night and that is affecting your health that is affecting your mental peace as well so you need to let go those habits those bad habit as well whatever is holding you back from thriving whatever is holding you back from being the best version you can be you need to let it go you need to release it and a stag is also very alert they are very mindful so you need to be very mindful you know uh, how the stags they have to be very alert or else they will get hunted so you need to be very alert whatever is happening in the universe you need to be mindful about it if you are getting any synchronicities any signs any symbols any messages in a song any messages in a book you need to understand what that messages are because that that will help you thrive that will help you grow so if you trust the person you are with if that person helps you thrive if that person helps you let go of your past if that person helps you release your bad habits then that is the one now let's see what else we are getting faith wow humanity and benevolence so we already felt that this person is someone who believes in the creator who believes in the universe so they have hope they are very faithful as well they have faith they have hope and maybe you don't feel that faith or hope currently you are feeling that no it is not going to happen in your life maybe this person is too good too good for you or maybe uh, you are not good enough or maybe uh, this is uh, this will never happen for you or it will never work out for you then you are being called to have faith it is working it is working in your favor it is working it will work in your favor the blue in this card is just like the blue in this in the water in this card and it is telling me that your emotions your throat chakra and your emotions they definitely need some work so if you are if you can meditate if you can work on your throat chakra if you can meditate and work on your heart chakra then you need to do that so that you will feel the faith you will feel that you deserve this reality it is not something which you don't deserve or you are not good enough no you are good enough the universe does want you to understand that the universe is also telling you to stay calm trust the good in yourself and others see the light in the world the universe is telling you to be calm to stay calm have patience things are happening in your favor if you are right now not feeling hopeful then you are being told to stay calm don't feel don't get panicked don't feel it it is never going to happen for you have patience trust in the good in yourself see the good in yourself first believe that you deserve this reality believe that you deserve this abundance believe that you deserve this amazing person and see the light in the world so that is the message this the universe wants you to give to have faith it is coming in your life if this person when you look at this person and you see faith if this person is a person who's kind to other people then they are the job then they are your person now what else we can see from the tarot wow look at this 10 of cups chariot okay now i understood maybe you are confused maybe you are not very not aware about because this also talks about confusion you know you have a lot of choice or you have uh, some kind of confusion or you're not you're handling many things at a time you're juggling many things 
and uh, that is what is creating a lot of um, this something which is in dark or something which is not clear to you or confusion or uh, even of uh, illusions or even you think that this is just wishful thinking it is not going to happen so you need to be more clear about what exactly you want what exactly you are looking for where exactly your focus should be when you are get clear about it then you will start feeling hey faith you will start feeling the faith you will start feeling hopeful you need to trust in your own intuitions and trust that you deserve this happiness you deserve this person because this is your reality 10 of cups we'll see that later wow this is also another uh, important marriage card soulmate card 11 11 i did see 11 11 when i was recording yours as well so 11 you might be seeing a lot of 11 11 and you also might be seeing a lot of 7 7 7 we have these two seven cards or 1 1 so you might be getting a lot of synchronicities lot of messages from the universe so even if you are not feeling hopeful right now even if you don't have faith that you deserve this reality the universe is telling you no don't lose faith this amazing person is going to be a part of your life you this is your twin flame this is your soulmate this is someone you are going to end up marrying this is someone you are going to end up having a family with maybe you are being called to move somewhere move location move jobs move uh, or mentally move yourself from the dark to the light so there is some kind of movement which might happen in your life or you are being called to do it so you need to take that charge take that control this is also about control so you need to take control over whatever you are juggling if you are juggling multiple things you need to take control over that and focus on one thing at a time multitasking don't don't work actually multitasking actually makes life more chaotic you need to focus one thing at a time you know focus on one thing at a time complete it achieve it then go to the other one so that you can give your 100% to whatever you are doing so that kind of control that kind of charge even will power if you don't feel that you have a strong will power and that is why you are doing something which is self sabotaging like staying late at night eating junk food any kind of addiction so any thing which needs will power to release will power to let go will power to change then that is hap- that is coming that is what this card is about this card is about control will power success so there is also success in your life so if your person is someone who is always in charge has a very good control on their life has a strong will power is successful that's why they have the abundance they are action oriented they are determined and i did feel something about a car when i saw this and they have a beautiful car because this also talks about a car they have a beautiful car they are very uh, possessed obsessed or they love or they are very proud of their car they are very determined they love traveling if this is the person you are thinking about or the person you are currently dating then yes they are the one and this was also a cancer card so we have cancer we have scorpio pisces what i can see because we have two uh, water cards as well cup cards as well and uh, this is about abundance luxury self sufficiency financially in financial independence so if you are currently not financially independent or you feel that you don't have enough then you need to trust that you will thrive you will grow you will get the financial independence your harvest time will come your luxurious time will come you will fe- start feeling financially strong it is definitely going to come maybe this person is going to help you achieve that in your life maybe you meet this person through work or they are your client or you are their client some what work kind of aspect is also there mm what else and yes the 10 of cups is about divine love 
it's about blissful relationship it is it is about happy family life it is about having kids having a beautiful house this is about total harmony this is about being very uh, being aligned with your true reality 10 of cups they already have that power to bring in this reality you are not trusting in your power you need to embrace that magician within yourself they are already the magician they are already at this level they are already abundant you need to reach their level you need to and uh, like uh, try to remove your illusions try to release whatever doesn't serve you try to grow yourself spiritually emotionally become very focused about what you want to achieve where you want to go move towards whatever your calling is whatever is whatever is telling you to uh, you know change your job or move country move location any kind of movement be it in your mental mind also like you need to release let go leave any bad habits any that kind of movement any that kind of changes or 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 literally moving locations so you need to rise up to their level when you vibrate on their uh, like with them at that level then you will create this reality and have faith you have that power you are the manifester you are the magician you are already meant to be with them they are your soulmate whatever the obstacles are you need to overcome them there is so there are some messages for you in pile number 1 do check it out you need to overcome those obstacles this person is there for you and the, and you need to you don't need to hurry anything you don't need to rush anything they are not going to go away they are meant to be with you so if if this is the person you are resonating with if this is the messages you are resonating with then definitely have faith that they are the one now let's see what messages we can get from our uh, other techniques we have some fun techniques like alphabets like uh, charms do check out pile number 1 you will definitely get some information in pile number 1 doctor we have a doctor that's why maybe they are so abundant doc some doctors do make a lot of money lots of doctors make a lot of money and they are very passionate about their career as well about whatever they, because they have spent a lot of time learning and developing those skills so they are very passionate about it oh one letter fell i'll pick it up new something and why new york maybe new york is important for you one letter did it fell down r k n r so see if you can make any words any any initials any messages from this we have the coins as well yes they have money they have lot of money it they have a lot of abundance and they are very well protected as well and you will get this you have this divine protection as well so don't be afraid to take any chances don't be afraid to move somewhere or to start something new you are being protected by the divine money you one of you is extremely abundant very rich and the other one not so much but don't worry you are that that the other person is also making their money is also becoming financially independent focus you need to focus on what you love what works for you four you might be seeing a lot of 444 we already saw 11 11 and 777 777 so you might be seeing a lot of synchronicities a wheel of fortune a complete change a 360 degree change is coming in your life when you meet this person or when you connect with this person or if this person makes you feel that uh, you your entire life is changing for good changing for better then they are the one you need to work on your passion this also came in pile number 1 you need to work on your passion you need to work on something which you love something focus on something which you cherish 
focus on one thing at a time if you are doing multiple things and it's not working in your favor then you need to focus on one thing or few things instead of seven focus on two or three things few things at a time so that you can do your best work you can give your best to the, to that project so this is about focusing on your passion and we have a sword so definitely cut anything which does not serve you anything which does not serve you needs to be released needs to be taken away from your life you do not want to spend any time or energy on those things which does not help you we have a butterfly over here so yes a complete transformation is coming in your life we did see this forest fairy who has butterfly wings so a complete transformation is coming in your life they have a very beautiful heart they are known to be a very kind person a very sweet person a sweet heart a very beautiful heart and yes money they have a lot of money we did see that already in the first card itself now some stickers and then we have some handmade cards as well to give more information of this amazing person and whatever doubts you have that uh, you are not good enough or any kind this kind of illusions you have oh god i picked a lot then you are me you need to let it go you are one in million yes the universe is telling you that don't feel that you are not getting good enough you are one in million they are also going to make you feel that you are one in million so whatever doubts are you, or whatever uh, feels uh, you are not feeling confident or good enough then no you are one in million gemini you or your person might be gemini my god so many did i pick pisces you or your person might be pisces switzerland you or your person might be from switzerland or will, will visit switzerland call us spirit has a plan you or your, you and your person might have met online will meet online or chat and talk a lot online terrific job the universe is telling you terrific job don't feel that you are not doing good enough and they will also they might also tell you terrific job you or your person might love having tea or love, enjoy tea busy bee they are a very busy bee a honey bee is also about hard work uh, sweet results the, the honey makes honey so they are it's also about getting sweet results from your hard work magical results divine pattern creativity teamwork and honey never spoils so this relationship is forever nothing is going to spoil this commitment or spoil this relationship it is forever and it is very healing as well so this person is very healing and uh, this relationship is going to be very healing for you turkey this came in pile 1 you and your person might be from turkey or will visit turkey yes we did see doctor so they might be someone who has studied a lot we have books or reads a lot or you like that you enjoy studying reading this is spirit has a plan again these both have the same way and this is also believing in the great mystery believing in big mystery believing that the uh, creator the divine has a plan for you and it's a big plan this is a big this is a big animal so it's a very big plan so trust have faith something is working for you butterfly again transformation you are completely being transformed into a new person this is about flying high soaring above this is about soaring above your obstacles soaring above your uh, whatever you feel is uh, is challenging for you going beyond that going upwards taking a high road it also says flying so maybe this chariot means you are going to fly somewhere fan fashion you or your person might be interested in fashion or have enough money to uh, have high end fashion clothes accessories or will give you give you gift you fashion accessories or you might be into fashion industry wow wolf i love this car this symbol wolf is turn your knowledge into wisdom the spirit guide wolf is very powerful you whenever you feel that uh, you need help or you need some kind of support you should always call upon wolf so always say uh, divine wolf uh, 
or spirit guide wolf please help me and you will get that help i have experienced it many times i always do it doctor oh my god so many times we are getting the message of doctor they are some kind of doctor some kind of healer italy you or your person might be from italy or will go to italy travel to italy maybe flying is also about traveling to many places many countries this also came in pile 1 this is about great mystery this is no not great mystery sorry this is about memories so you need to release your past release your release whatever uh, trauma you are holding on to your in your, with your memories keep the lessons Le release the memories release the feeling release the trauma keep the lessons slowly and steadily you are moving in the right direction and this also talks about long term so it's a long term relationship 7 or july mexico this also came in pile 1 you or your person might be from mexico see if any hints are coming up for this person poland you or your person might be from poland music you or your person might be interested in music like music even dances there so music dance some instrument some talent some creative talent you or your person might have today is a new day that is another confirmation from the universe that your days are going to change for the better light hair light skin you or your person might have that singing we have another music singing symbol so someone must be very talented in music money yes they have money piggy bank they have a lot of money again money there is no doubt that they have a lot of money or you have a lot of money or together you will have a lot of money china so you're going to even travel the world with this person there because we're getting almost every country aries very beautiful relationship or maybe they must be very much interested in traveling don't lose focus we got the focus charm so this is the message which the universe is telling you don't lose focus stay on your path teacher they might be a teacher as well or you might be a teacher wow this is again uh, like you are good enough you know a uh, hummingbird they say that should not fly physically uh, as per science as per physics they should they are not they should not be capable of flying but they do fly and they fly very gracefully so even if someone is telling you that you are not good enough or your dreams are too big then don't believe them because the divine has a plan for you the spirit has a plan for you Virgo, you or your person might have Virgo in the chart. Trick or treat, you will have a lot of fun time during Halloween. Maybe wear a lot of couple costumes and all that kind. And or if when you'll have kids, you will be someone who will enjoy with your kids. Uh, or they might be someone who likes dressing up on Halloween. That is one more clue for you. This is going with the flow. This is a generous, very, they, they are very generous. We already said that. So they are very generous and uh, they are very kind, very positive. Germany, I did say that you are going to travel the world or they might be from one of this country or you might be a veterinarian. We already had the doctor. So they might be a veterinarian or they might have a lot of pets or they might love animals or love caring for animals. Taurus, Halloween, yes, we got Halloween twice. So you're going to have a fun Halloween time. Do what makes you happy. Wow, we got stag, we got deer. Wow, look at this synchronicity again. Gentle, diplomatic, mindful, alert. That is what the deer spirit talks about. And this stag spirit is telling you to trust, trust and thrive. Believe in you, yes. Believe in yourself first. This person definitely believes in you. But you need to believe in yourself first. Dream big. Cancer. God, I picked so many stickers. Spain. Japan. Yes, you are traveling the world. And we have another Japanese symbol, koi fish. This is also abundance. This is grace. This is beauty. This is yin yang symbol. Calm. Reach for the stars. We already... Oh, did I already did say that that if you have a special talent like you are a singer you are a dancer or a musician start working on it United States you might become a star as well Australia 
yes the world you are traveling the world with this person and this is coming very fast or this relationship is going to grow very fast so if your relationship is growing very fast then th that is the one and it is this also talks about fertility so be careful because this is a very fertile person and you are also a very fertile person so be careful if you don't have want to have kids right away music again might be a musician might be a dj might be a dancer might be a singer might be into music industry or you might be that's the spirit oh my god many stickers many stickers now let's go for the handmade cards we are going to pick six cards and see what extra messages or extra clues we are getting from this person if they are the one free spirited they might be free spirited or for this is for you protector yes they are they are definitely a protector planner yes they are a planner which we felt in the chariot card a planner a person who is very much in control of their career of their life online connection didn't we see that online connection dm sm online connection hashtag online connection great communication skills again we have this chatting bubble so yes online connection chatting talking they have great communication skills and brown eyes we had the, we can see this beautiful brown eyes so one of you have has big beautiful brown eyes and the other one has blue eyes take as it resonates and that's it for you for now pile number 2 thank you so much for all your subscriptions all your messages all your comments thank you so much for being here thank you for your time i hope you got the message you're looking for and uh, i'll see you in my next one thank you again for being here Welcome pile 3 today's reading is are they the one let's see what messages we have connection oh wow i love this card this card was there uh, the other day in the reading and uh, i love this location so um are you some are you with someone who loves beaches with some or excuse me or you want to be with someone who loves beaches you know or you're the other one who, who loves beaches or uh want to go on romantic trip with your special one or your planning or you have already uh, went for you already went for this kind of trip or you exchange a lot of letters or you send each other sweet romantic songs so if you are can in with that person right now then yes this is the one this is the one for you someone who would like to take you to see the world or someone who travels a lot for their career for their work or someone who definitely enjoys uh, spending time in the nature you know they love long walks on the beach they love uh, uh, being sleeping under the stars they love uh, campaigning they love uh, trekking they love uh, adventures uh, outdoor adventures and they want to spend a lot of time outside like uh, rather than spending into uh, normal indoor restaurants or normal movie theaters and all they would rather spend time outside so if that is the person you are with then the yes they are the one so this is one confirmation for it and definitely they or they might have uh, their origin in a beautiful paradise place like hawaii like bali like um, um any uh, mauritius uh any play or like any places where uh, the beaches are important mexico where the beaches beaches are known for their beauty so any that that kind of location are they from that that kind of location and they always tell you that they want to take you there or they always tell you that uh, they would love to go on vacation on a beach place if that is the person you are with or that is the person you are thinking about then yes they are the one and this also talks about connection and we can see this letter over here so maybe this is an online connection or maybe you are sharing a lot of messages to each other or sending a lot of letters or mails or this can also be an uh, office connection or a work connection where you met them through work or Uh, they are your client or your other client or some or the other way you got connected online and now uh, when you met you started sharing each others 
uh, hobbies or each other interest and you found out that you have a lot in, in common and then you started chatting you started talking and you uh, plan a trip somewhere uh, exotic somewhere beautiful that also might be a pl that also might be a scenario or you love uh, those uh, romantic um, music music which is uh, which uh, is a very laid back music which is like the beach boys which is like which uh, like the hawaiian music which takes you in a very different uh, place mentally which makes you feel so uh, like you are in a paradise so that kind of uh, person if this is then yes they are the one they might be very skilled in music as well or a singing or a singer because this music is going so beyond everybody so like they they might be very skilled in that that as well they love uh, enjoying uh, having champagne or having wine with you they love spending alone time with you if they are the person then yes they are the one they are your one let's see what more messages the spirits have for you sky father trust in the unknown okay so if you don't know this person yet if the, or if this they are uh, uh, they you don't know much about them you have just connected online that you are being called to trust in the unknown the sky father the god has your back they might have beautiful blue eyes or you might have beautiful blue eyes or brown eyes they might be from usa as well because this is about you the eagle is the symbol of usa or the animal of usa so they might be from usa as well or they might be living in usa right now and uh, this the sky father the god tells you to trust in the trust in the uh, in the universe trust in the unknown trust in the divine trust in your spirit guides trust if you are seeing a lot of eagles or lot of crows uh, then you are being called to trust in your uh, animal guides spirit guides because they are definitely giving you a lot of information and there is thundering lightning happening over here so maybe you meet uh, into a tropical place or a tropical uh, location where you know in the those these kind of tropical places even the, the rain is very heavy even the uh, climates like these thundering lightning they happen very often so maybe you met into that, that that kind of period or that kind of duration during those days when there was a lot of thundering a storm hurricane or uh, Uh, some kind of um, weather uh, activity some kind of weather disturbance which was going on which may have stopped uh, coming commute which may have stopped work or school so that kind of situation also might be uh, when you met this person a snow day uh, a storm stormy weather hurricane weather or uh, heavy rain rain or thundering so that also might be when you met this person if you did then this is a sign that they are the one and when you all first you are being called to trust in the unknown trust in the universe trust in your guides trust in the downloads you are getting and now you are being called to expand your soul so mahavata baba ji is about meditation about kriya yoga about if you if you want to know about kriya yoga there is a lot of information about it online and if you want to know about meditation then that also you can do you can study a lot of guided meditations you can follow them and uh, that is also you how you can expand your true uh, expand your soul expand your third eye or or uh, become more aware become more awakened connect with the higher guides connect with the unknown connect with the universe connect with the divine and that is what you are being called to do so mahavatar baba ji tells you to that your connection is expanding so we got consciousness so your consciousness and connection is below your con consciousness is expanding so you are becoming more spiritual you are becoming more spiritually aware you are becoming more uh, awakened your ex your ex third eye might be becoming awakened or your chakras might be aligning or your your soul might be becoming more aware of the scenario or you might be getting some information some hints through songs through something you read or through mess through dreams this might also be a dream for you that you are at a very romantic very beautiful place with your person this also might be a dream which you which you saw in a night which was a download from you uh, from the universe 
and uh, your connection your understanding the connection between all things connection connection so definitely there is something related to connection now this can be online connection this can be work connection this can be connection through some songs this can be connection from through from some messages this can be connection which you get as downloads when you meditate when you sleep uh, when you're reading when you're listening to songs when you're doing something which you love doing like you are driving and some you see a billboard you see uh, angel numbers you see synchronicities or you hear something on the radio so any kind of connection any way the universe is trying to connect with you the any way your guides your spiritual guides your angels are trying to connect with you then definitely you need to focus on those messages which are coming towards you because those messages will help you uh, know that which who is exactly your person who your person is where you can find them how you can connect with them and you are being called to meditate this also ca card is about meditation con contemplation uh, revelation so you might be focusing on your past habits your past beliefs and you are being called to open your mind you are being called to see beyond what you know you are being called to trust in the unknown and take this new cup which is coming towards you now this new cup might be this person who's presenting their love to you or this can can be a new opportunity to grow to expand to become more independent mentally physically financially to move somewhere to move towards a new beautiful location to do something new to expand your soul to expand your thinking to expand your creativity so some opportunity is coming from the divine from the un from the sky father from the god himself or from the from the uh, you know whoever you believe in whoever the divine is for you from the divine himself from the divine themselves i won't say himself because um, the divine feminine energy is also very strong so from the universe itself a big new opportunity is coming for you so you need to look beyond what you already know and for that you need to meditate for that you need to sit and understand what you need exactly in your life if something needs to go then you need to know what needs to go if something needs to grow if something needs to improve if something needs study if something needs research if something needs attention something needs medication whatever is needed you need to think about it if you, your person might be somebody who is very much into meditation who is very much into uh, spirituality who might even uh, know a lot of, about spirituality so if that person discusses a lot of spiritual things with you then they are the other one the world okay traveling is involved so you might travel to the travel to this person or this person might travel to you or you together might travel to some beautiful play, place to some beautiful location this is also about completion so you need to complete something maybe something needs completion something needs your attention a project a work assignment your school something your uh, education something needs completion which you need to work on which you need to uh, take care of completion world travel and this is about the fixed sign so your person might have scorpio aquarius leo taurus in their in their birth chart or you may have so if somebody who is uh who has these signs or who is someone who you look up to someone who definitely completes whatever they start who, who takes their project seriously who are who is successful in their work life in their career if that is your person then yes they are the one they might even be involved with you in your in your career in your work they might be working in the same place where you are you might be a partner to them in your work this talks about teamwork this talks about collaboration so you might have even collaborated with them you might be working in two different places two different organizations you might have two different careers uh, you might have your own work your own creative project your own creative assignment and they collaborate with you they come together uh, with you and you work on some project you might be a part of team 
if that is uh, resonating with you then they yes they are the one this also talks about going beyond your current situation there's a beach over here as well just like this card so maybe beach is something or a sea or a ocean place or traveling above the ocean or uh, you know uh, going beyond your current location might be a case or they might be into another part of the world so if that is what is resonating then yes they are the one and uh, two of wands is about future planning about progress about decisions about discovery so your person might be very optimist they always plan their future they have very set target very set goals very much uh, aware of where they want to go what they want to achieve because they are they have very clear in their mind they they meditate they journal they believe their spirit guides they trust the uh, trust the universe their soul is expand, expanded already their third eye is open already so they are very clear about where they want to go they do they have they are a planner they believe in planning they believe in continuously developing continuously learning they are constantly learning they might read a lot they might study a lot they might be into self improvement self development they are always trying to discover new ways to develop themselves to improve themselves that might be how how they are or you might have to travel to meet them or they might have to travel to meet you or uh, you are in two different locations two different places one of you might be living near an ocean or you might be you might travel to an ocean with them they are very passionate about their work about their life about everything uh, they have in their life about their career they are very highly energetic they are very passionate they are they take uh, actions as per their inspire in about the as per the inspiration that comes up in their mind they are very adventurous they love to travel they are very impulsive very passionate they are very attracted towards you they are very they feel deeply passionate towards you they want to swift you off your feet they want to always be very close to you, to you physically they are very attracted towards you they feel very passionate when they see you if you are currently not physically uh, close then they want to they want to take this at the next level so if that person resonates with you then yes they are the one now let's see what more information we are getting from other techniques like uh, any alphabet any initials any messages any place names r rio rio is also a place which is known for its beaches doctor they they might be a doctor they might be into healing healers they might be uh, someone who studies a lot have a doctorate like phd or a scientist something like that nurse rn nurse hat they might wear a hat or a cap they might like wearing hat or a cap real this person is real this person is not someone who show off or not someone who manipulates or who cheats or who lies they'd like to keep it real because they are very awakened oh very well protected the universe has your back sky father is looking upon on you looking on you one of you might have dark hair the other one might have light hair so we have dark hair we have light hair one of you might have dark eyes even black and the other one might have blue eyes you have the divine protection the divine guidance and your person definitely has it and they believe in it they respect it they value it a complete transformation you and your person are feel going through a complete transformation at least you are being called to 
take this transformation seriously meditate expand your soul daughter is slowly steadily she this shield uh, the shell also is a shield which will protect you they will make you feel very protected very cherished if they do then they are the one passion yes they are very passionate very passionate about what they do what they work inner child your inner child needs some healing that's why the father sky wants to help you your inner child needs healing maybe that is what you need to let go that is what you need to stop thinking about and think about the new things or this also might be a baby you have with them past this came in all three readings the elephant the elephant is about uh, learning from your past memories so heal your inner child let go of the trauma but keep the lessons focus we have to focus so focus on what you want to achieve focus on your passion like they focus on their passion want yes they are very passionate very passionate extremely passionate highly sexual as well money they are making good amount of money with whatever they do whatever they are passionate about whatever they love doing another butterfly transformation and these two butterflies are different so you might be from two different places you might look different but you are uh, are very much alike internally they have a beautiful heart that is how you know they are the that is your person target you need to focus on your target what exactly oh god the three flew away what exactly you need to achieve that you need to focus on your target what exactly you want there is no reason for that three to fly away the window is closed maybe the spirits want to tell some message i don't know they want some attention i don't know oh compass so you are being guided towards this person and this person is being guided towards you there might be someone who is focus who is helping you focus on what you need to do who is helping you improve in your own career let go of the past autumn autumn months might be important for you release your past beauty they will make you feel very cherished very beauty they will make you feel very attractive and this is also about the moon and star so your whatever is hidden whatever is dark will be will be uh, will get the light will will be will be uncovered that message i heard when i saw the moon and star now let's see the sticker stickers if we can see some information in the stickers and then we have handmade cards as as well yes the universe has your back this is the spirit guide the spirit guide uh, the wolf is about turn your knowledge into wisdom the wolf is about connecting with the divine asking divine's help so if you need divine's help any time in your life you should always call upon spirit guides and wolf is a very powerful spirit guide the spirit the spirit of wolf animal spirit wolf is very powerful you can always pray to animal spirit wolf you can call the spirit for your help and it always helps just pray to the spirit that uh, divine wolf or spirit wolf or spirit guide wolf please help me overcome this scenario overcome this situation or guide me or help me and you will instantly find a solution it always works i completely believe in the power of uh, spirit of wolf oh god <laughs> everything is flying what is happening maybe you are going to fly fly towards this person butterfly complete transformation we have already saw two butterflies in charms canada you or your person might be in canada we already felt you as a we also have india over here and any beach place like mexico rio uh, maldives mauritius uh many many places where wherever hawaii wherever the beaches are famous your possum 
might have pets with them or they might already have pets this is about grace beauty abundance yin yang balance calm this is also about calm zen so they are very zen they are very calm they meditate which we already felt that a very laid back very somebody who is who is not very aggressive in fact very calm removing your obstacles this is about removing your obstacles destroying your obstacles going beyond your obstacles overcoming the obstacles being very forceful taking a stand in what you believe chef they might be a chef or uh, you might be a chef or they might uh, enjoy cooking for you or you might do enjoy doing that lawyer you or they might be a lawyer go for it you are this is one more uh, go ahead card which you got china you or your person might be from china or you would travel there with them because you already have so many flying things so there are high chances of you traveling germany you or your person might be from there soulmate they are your soulmate this came in pile 2 they are your soulmate and dolphin is also about looking at the positive side dolphin is also about uh, focusing on positivity being playful silver lining so they are very playful very laid back very playful very nice energy and they are your soulmate dream big you are being called to dream big december or number 111 number 222 or 12 12 might be important even 11 11 or december month may might be important for you this is about taking care of small issues minor issues don't uh, avoid any minor issues especially if you are moving countries then be very careful about all documentations don't avoid anything uh, this is uh, money so definitely you or both of you have a lot of money or they make money with what they are passionate about they make a good amount of money with what they are passionate about heart chakra i am loved that is your affirmation i am loved and your heart chakra needs healing or uh, your heart chakra is getting the healing we got another eagle see eagle eagle wow beautiful so you are soaring high you are flying you are moving beyond your restrictions you are moving beyond your current situation you are definitely flying towards this person or this person is flying towards you usa might be a strong connection also march uh, you might uh, talk with this person in march meet this person in march go on this trip in march or have birthday in march 333 might be one other number you are seeing 12 is also 1 plus 2 3 so 33 you might be seeing a lot music you or your person must might have talent in music vogo another musical instrument music might be something which you because we already have this music symbol so you or your person might be into music or their passion might be music as well their uh, their profession might be into music as well switzerland one more country ballet so we have dance music singing musical instruments this is releasing your past and this is uh, learning from your past learning from your memories money yes you both have good amount of money or you will have a nice piggy bank a nice bank balance piggy bank but bank balance they have the heart, key to your heart or you have the key to your, their heart music keys are also there so music is something which is coming up again and again this came in pile 2 as well this also came in pile 2 dear being they are very gentle which i already felt very gentle diplomatic mindful very aware about everything which is happening around them very aware of the spiritual world as well study they must be doing a lot of research a lot of study today is a new day maybe you met them while studying or while working while researching because we have multiple people studying here bear they are very protective the way he is holding her very protective like a a bear hug that is how they will hold you like very protective and this is also taking rest so they might be very laid back they might be someone who loves to sleep loves to nap loves to take rest 
that also might be how you can know that they are your they are your person they are very chilled very zen very rela relaxed crown i am your crown chakra also needs some attention so heart chakra crown chakra so if you can find any meditations for that another dating see wine dating dinner so definitely you are going to spend a beautiful date nights with them or any kind of dates with them germany one more country water yes beach was prominent so they might be someone who loves enjoys water or enjoys being around water or water helps them with their creativity if they are a songwriter musician then or a author writer sorry then water is something which helps them with their creativity they like to hear the sound of the ocean they like to swim in the ocean or in a lake or in a river or near a water fly or they like to be in the water as much as possible they might even be a water sign so water is something which came up strongly in this reading uh, this is about grace beauty so they are very graceful very calm very uh, zen very um, like not harsh not in your face someone very graceful someone very sweet which is nice which is a gentle actually a gentleman which is beautiful sacral chakra another chakra which needs some attention and united states yes finally united state we already saw so many eagles and then united state and canada is already there that finally it came up because hawaii was so strong so you know i felt united states so these are the stickers for you now let's see handmade cards if we can get some more information some more hints some more clues about this person to know if they are the one if this is resonating with you do let me know if this is not resonating with you then you can definitely check other piles other readings thank you so much for being here thank you for all your love support your comments your subscriptions thank you so much and uh, i hope i hope you are enjoying the reading and if you have any suggestions please let me know mentally and physically strong mentally they are definitely strong they are a meditator they are someone who is mentally very balanced emotionally very balanced very calm mentally they don't panic they are very much control about their emotions so mentally they are very strong and now we got the physical also aspect physically also they are very strong and they are physically they are going to be very attracted towards you self discipline yes they are very self disciplined because they meditate because they are very well aware they are very self disciplined maybe they wake up early morning and uh, focus on their work they have set time table set rules so if that is your person then yes they are the one courageous they are very courageous you need to be very courageous to follow your heart and they do follow their heart they do follow their passion so they are courageous wants a family they want a family they will they will talk about a family with you then you know that they are the person blue eyes we already felt that right blue eyes and dark eyes so they might have blue eyes lucky they feel that they are very lucky or you will feel that you are very lucky to have them in your life or you together you will feel very lucky so that might be one way you know that they are the one do let me know if this reading resonated with you if you have any suggestions do let me know that as well thank you so much for being here thank you for everything your all your support and i hope you are enjoying the reading and do let me know if you have any suggestions i'll see you in my next one